uh, as you mentioned that there are four sources to any problem or chaos in life uh, my my question is how would one recognize that where is this uh, problem emanating from uh, to distinguish which theory word should one deploy whether is it past life or whether it is ancestral or whether right. it is home based or whether it is uh, you know uh, the current life childhood yes living. right very good question how do we know the source or the origins of some problem illness that we have and uh, it's like a, just uh, a, a metaphor uh, analogy that i give sometimes when we want information in the current days and what we do is we have the google we type the question in the google and then uh, all the possible answers it gathers and we get the our consciousness is a big google server you know more than that it's infinite uh, information and uh, wisdom and all that uh, is carried by our consciousness it has uh, every answer in it so when we have that quest the quest begins when we have a, a limitation in the physical plane it could be any physical limitation like illness and when we understand that when we have the quest oh what is the source why am i having this limitation how can i become again unlimited how can i come out of this limit raise above the limitation then the search begins and our consciousness searches for the answers actually in meditation people get the access to this um the causes and effects are understood in a normal way but some they also resort to the additional help they can because they can uh, look into the source the origins of it because that's what is the therapy work is about because that we have as a uh, human beings a natural defense mechanisms mm -hmm. we defend ourselves from the the trauma the trauma that occurred in the childhood or in the womb or in the past lives or in the ancestry what happens is that, that defense mechanism makes us bypass totally we spiritually bypass sometimes meditation becomes like a we go into meditation into zero state but we will not be progressing it is like a, a numbness layer that is created so some they recognize that numbness which is created by defense strategy and some they don't they need someone a therapist to look into themselves so i have been practicing as a past life regression therapist i hold the space for the clients i recognize their defense strategies and by spiritual bypass mechanisms i make them to embrace the trauma actually make them address to look into the trauma so this is what i've been doing and uh, people were benefited from that but i my advice is i ask them everyone to try on their own mm -hmm. first you have to become so aware and drop all that defenses because past is already over looking into the past is not really um, a problematic thing because it's already the past is over only you are going there to learn the lessons of it mm -hmm. the past which is learned lessons are learned and the past won't repeat otherwise the same uh, theme of illness or limitation it recurs it repeats that is whole concept is about thank you mehul ji for the thank question thank you so much sir thank you so much yeah yeah Welcome. thank you